everybody and welcome welcome back to my youtube channel so today i am off to london um so i have declared 2024 as my year of doing stuff my year of being doing stuff on my own in particular and just living the year um, so it is i don't want to date today 17th january maybe and i am off to london on my own today i am running late that is why i'm starting the video like this would it be a Charlie video if I wasn't running late? No. Um, but I thought I'd bring you along for the day and I'm so excited. I want to start doing so much more on this channel in regards to like travelling and going places and stuff. Um, they're doing it alone diaries. <laughs> London Liverpool Street. Um, I did miss my train so I had to get a train that was like half an hour later because I got uh, one minute late um, and the train left but I'm now at Liverpool Street and I'm going to go to M&S quickly to get some food and then go get the tube. While I'm walking I'm gonna talk to you guys because I haven't really discussed it much on my channel but I've got a chronic illness called fibromyalgia and I sort of want to start incorporating more awareness of it into my videos kind of talking about you know how I do stuff with my chronic illness like obviously today i'm at london all by myself all day and i have to have rest breaks i get tired very easily all that sort of stuff so i want to kind of like start incorporating just sort of like talking about a little bit more on my channel but i'm trying to rush right now because i want to get to m and and then get the tube which is at what time is it 12 past i think I'm almost at m and i'm hoping they've got what i want because I've been craving this like yogurt granola pot they've got. Um, I don't know if they should sell it at this one, but we'll have a look. I've been to Marx's, I've got a strawberry yogurt and granola pot, which I'm gonna eat on the tube. So I think I've got to spend about 15 minutes on the tube. Um, but it's so cold today. It's absolutely freezing, but I managed to find where the tube is. So I think I know what direction it's in, but I just need to find it. I have now made it to Embankment. I need to find somewhere to put my rubbish. I'm surprised I haven't found the bin yet. But I am now walking to a shop called Wizard and Wonders, which is a Harry Potter shop. Um, because basically my plan is, I've got two art gallery museums I want to go to and two Harry Potter shops I want to go to. So first roll call is the Harry Potter shop so got, got my Google Maps going and I'm gonna find that first <laughs> so I'm now walking past the National Gallery which is actually where I'm gonna come back to in a minute but first of all I am going to the Harry Potter shop and honestly I am the worst with like directions and finding my way I've literally got Google Maps on and I still just got lost um, I have got no sense of direction at all but it's okay I'm getting there at least I know now where the Nesta Gallery is, so I know where to come back to once I've finished at the Harry Potter shop. I am done with the first Harry Potter shop. I didn't buy anything just because I've... The next shop I'm going into, I've been into this one before and I know there's more in this one. Um, so I'm going to go to this one, I mean I'll pass that one on the way back anyway, so you know, but I'm going to go to this one now because there's more and it's bigger so I might find more that I like. I was walking the wrong way, I had to do an awkward turn in the road to turn back the right way. I'm a Hufflepuff and why is a Hufflepuff colours always the ugliest? It's so unfair. <laughs> I have now finished at House of Spells and I actually ended up getting a bracelet and some, a couple of charms because I've got a Pandora bracelet with charms and I thought it'd be really, really cute if I could have like a matching one but with Harry Potter. Um, so I bought that and I'll show you those later. Um, but I've now got about 15 ish minutes until my art gallery booking is um, and only taking like a five minute walk so I'll have I'll probably get their perfect timing actually because I meant to get the five minutes early so I'll probably get their perfect timing um, 
I mean, obviously when I'm in there I can have like a sit down and stuff, so that is good. Um, but yeah, so um, when I was in the Harry Potter shops, I did actually want to get um, like a jumper or something. Oh, so let me go this way. Do I go this way? Wait a sec. Okay, so this isn't the way I came from, but it's the way that I expected to go, so I'll go this way. Um, but yeah, I did originally want to get a jumper. Oh, I'm doing like a little red carpet moment. What's well, a blue carpet actually? Blue carpet moment. <laughs> As I was saying, I did want to get like a jumper or something like that from the Harry Potter shops, but I really want to get the George Weasley Weasley jumper. They didn't have any of the Weasley jumpers, so I'm going to order it online at some point. I know they're quite expensive, but I really, really want one. And I think it'll also help me to like visualise my DR and stuff and feel closer to my DR. So, um, yes, I am going to order that online, but for now I've got the bracelet, which I'm really, really happy with. But, almost there. <laughs> okay, do we see it? So I think this direction has kind of taken me around the back of the gallery. So I'm hoping it's going to not direct me so I can go around the front of the gallery because that's obviously where I need to go in, not through the back. That's a bit dodgy. Um, but yeah, I think I'm almost there. Okay, I'm here. And I've got about five minutes now until I can go in. So I'm going to stand here and just look at it for five minutes. <laughs> artist of this also made the frame and I absolutely adore the frame, it's so pretty. The stars, but yeah, they shine for you. So I am now heading back to the tube station. It is just down there, if you can see. I've got about 10 15 minutes until my tube, um, but I'm gonna get there early so I can find it. Honestly, there was so much in the art gallery, I, don't, I definitely didn't see it all. There was definitely so much that I could have seen that I just didn't get around to. So, yeah, it's definitely worth it since it's free as well. It's completely free to go in. Um, and just look around and it's great so yeah also there was a busker just now that was singing and he played yellow by coldplay which i love that song so gave him some money because i love the song um, and he was a very good singer he's also australian which is kind of cool but is this the right station in bankman yes this is the right one okay good one thing i've learned with five Maja is the best way to do things is in sections because i want to go to quite a lot of different art museums and that needs to be a way to train As I was saying, there are so many places in London I want to go, like there's so many different art galleries, I want to go to the History Museum, the Science Museum, but with my condition, if I do too many in one go, it breaks me. Um, whereas, because I've just done one art gallery today, not mine, because I did one art gallery today at two shops, I'm, obviously I'm not feeling great, but I'm not like absolutely dead and want to cry either, that is not a nice sound. So I feel like it's a good balance because obviously I don't want to just do nothing because of my illness, like I'm not going to let it hold that. But at the same time, I can't overdo it. So it's a good way to do it. Right, next tube is my one. And then, oh, here it is. <laughs>
train and now I'm just going over Martley Bridge and then my mum has come to pick me up so I'm going to go meet her in the car park. Okay, it's freezing. But my mum is on, she lives on the third level, does that mean she's at the top of the car park? I'm going to have to give her a call to see where that she is. I think she lives on the third level, so I'm going to the car park. And yeah, today has been successful. Hello people, I am now home. Oh, stay. Ah! Where can I put you? Let's sit on the floor. I am now home from London and I've had a really, really good day today. Oh, my mascara is not off properly. Oopsies, let's do that together. I have to do it. it's a bit low, but we'll have to do. I was a little bit nervous today, just like navigating the tubes and just London itself, it's a very big place. Um, but it went really, really well, and I'm really glad that I did it. And I had a very good day, and I definitely want to go to London again on my own. And it's kind of about the starting point because I want to start doing, I want to start going places on my own and doing a bit of traveling in this country and abroad. So this is kind of a good start. I feel like London is a good start for that. So it's been a good day. Anyway, the bracelet that I bought today that I mentioned from the Harry Potter shop. Now I've got so many bracelets on my wrist, it's kind of hard to see. But basically, it's like a Pandora. So this is my Pandora bracelet. And it's like a Pandora bracelet, but it's like a Harry Potter one, obviously, and a lot cheaper. So on, like, the clasp, it says Harry Potter. And then I picked out two charms. Also, um, for reference, I got a size small bracelet. So the first charm I got was the Hogwarts Express ticket, which is so cute. And then this little one here, which I love. It's like Hogwarts at night. And it's just adorable so definitely going to be collecting these as well as all of my pandora charms and i've now got three bracelets on my wrist very clanky um but i love it so yes i am now home i'm having a chill evening tonight um just to relax pajamas are on i'm gonna go downstairs have some dinner lay on the sofa and probably watch a movie or something like that with my family um and have a very chill relaxed evening to zen myself um i also got quite a lot of reading done i'm currently reading to kill a mockingbird which my boss from work actually bought me because he recommended that i read it and then he found it in a charity shop so he got it for me which is very very kind of him um so yes i am um, i got quite a lot of reading done on the train because i love reading on the train it's great um but anyways yes thank you all for coming along with me today um if you've got any places in particular you want me to visit like you want me to do a little vlog of then let me know but thank you all so so much for joining me um on my little london trip today if you enjoyed it make sure you let me know in the comments and i will see you all soon bye